I would say that he, he's a traditional forward that can stretch the floor. Um, he, he, he bring that toughness. You can just look at him and just tell that he's tough. You know what I mean? He, he, he's a great rebounder. He's a, he's a good shot blocker, but he really, he really can, can score over either shoulder and he can stretch the floor. A lot of scouts look at him as, as, as a forward man, you know what I mean? But, you know, he, he was forced to play, you know, a big at, at Kansas, but he's really like a, a Carmelo Anthony type guy. He can score the ball from, you know, from different spots on the floor, you know what I mean? He, he plays at his own pace, so, you know, he, 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 he I think, you know, with a couple years, he's definitely going to be one of those guys who, who scored the ball really well, you know what I mean? He's a defender, too. He can definitely, you know, defend multiple positions. Number one. Take him number one, take me number two, man. You know, that's how it's got to be. But no, no, man, he, he, he's definitely, I feel like he's definitely underrated. You know, even though he's a lottery pick, he's definitely underrated. I think, you know, he definitely could be a top five pick. He, he has the potential, you know, to, to put some years in, in the league and then become one of those guys like a LeBron and like a Carmelo.